Hi, welcome to the RED program. This is the most challenging. Let's follow Paul as he demonstrates the exercises for us. For this program, you're gonna need a folded towel, a mat, a resistance band, and possibly a chair for some support. These bands can be purchased at most sporting goods stores or a surgical supply store. These come in a variety of colors, each with a corresponding resistance. The lighter the color, the easier the resistance. Yellow is the easiest as it progresses to black, which is the hardest. Please again select a resistance that you can perform each exercise comfortably and without pain. During the stretching portion of this program, you may feel discomfort or actually a burning sensation in the muscles. That's normal. But if at any time you feel significant discomfort inside of your knee, please stop what you're doing. Let's begin with some gentle stretches. The first stretch is the hurdler stretch. Standing near a step, chair, or bench that is one to two feet high, place the heel of your right leg onto it. Bend forward at the hip and using your hands as support, slowly try to reach towards your foot. Try not to bend at the shoulders or at the waist. You should feel a stretch at the back of your right thigh. Hold this position for 15 seconds and relax. The next stretch is the calf step stretch. Facing the wall, place your toes of your right foot against it. With your left leg comfortably behind you, gently bring your hips towards the wall. You should feel a gentle stretch in your right calf. Hold this position for 15 seconds and relax. The next stretch is the hip flexor stretch. Kneeling on a towel facing a wall or an object, Place your right leg forward with your foot flat so you are in a lunge position. Now lean forward at the hip, pressing your pelvis towards the floor. You can slightly arch your back to help feel the stretch in your quadriceps of your left leg. You can increase the stretch by bending the knee of the leg and grab it with your hand. Hold this position for 15 seconds and then relax. The iliotibial band stretch is done by lying on your back and taking your right leg, cross it over your body. Try to maintain a straight leg. Use your opposite hand to hold your outer calf or use a towel to assist the stretch. Hold this position for 15 seconds and then relax. The first strengthening exercise is the standing straight leg raise. In the standing position, if you need support, utilize a chair. Tie the band comfortably around your ankles with minimal slack. Stand on your left foot, tighten your right thigh muscle, and bring your right foot in front of you until you feel tolerable resistance. Hold this position for five seconds and then relax. The next exercise is standing hip extension. This is similar to the last exercise. From the same starting position, stand on your left foot, keep your knee straight, and bring your right leg behind you. You should feel this in your buttocks. Hold this for five seconds and relax. In the same position, we will perform the standing lateral straight leg raise. Stand on your left foot, keep your knee straight, and bring your right leg out to the side. You should feel this along the outside of your thigh. Hold this position for five seconds and relax. The next exercise is the inner straight leg raise. Sitting on a mat, place a, the loop of resistance band around your right ankle. Step into the band with the left foot behind your right ankle. Now lie on your side. Holding the band down with your left foot, lift your right leg six to 12 inches off the ground. Hold this position for five seconds and then relax. The last exercise is the single leg squat. Standing on your right foot with your knee slightly bent, keep your left leg out for balance and gently perform a partial squat. It's important to keep your weight behind your knee as if you're going to sit in a chair. You may want to attempt this with a chair behind you until you feel comfortable with this exercise. Please repeat this technique section as often as you need to until you feel comfortable with each exercise. It is very important that you know how to do each exercise before starting the main rehabilitation program. 